I graduated 2014 from my degree at the Conservatorium of Music and since then um, I've done a lot of stuff. I was Mabel in the Pirates of Penzance with Adrian Keefe and Simon Gallagher directed it. That was really cool. That was like straight out of uni. So that was like big, fun, exciting thing. It's true that he has gone astray, but pray, is that a reason good and true why you should all be deaf to Betty's name? And then I played Cinderella in Into the Woods, which was also really fun. Hi. Hello. Hi. And action. I'm wearing a curtain, I think. And then just recently I played Mary Poppins in Mary Poppins at the Gold Coast Arts Centre. I'm just about to go down to Sydney um, to be in My Fair Lady with Opera Australia and it's going to be at the Opera House and I'm in the ensemble and understudying Eliza Doolittle, the lead role, and Julie Andrews is directing it. So that has been my exciting life for the last year and a half since graduating from uni. It's a dream come true, you know? I can't even get over it. Sometimes I think is that it might be an elaborate prank or something because it just doesn't feel real sometimes. She, I met her in the auditions and she was so lovely. She was just so warm and gentle and supportive and just everything that you'd think she'd be and it was just such a surreal cool moment definitely the highlight of my career so far has been auditioning for Julie Andrews and now I get to work with her I'm over the moon I can't believe my life I will be living around the corner from the Opera House so I just get to stroll along the harbour to work every day just past the bridge hello Opera House this is where I work <laughs> Fair Home was super encouraging of performing arts. It was something that was really strong here and that I was so involved in. I loved all of the performing arts elements. I think I did every orchestra, every choir. I did all the dance troupe stuff and all of the school musicals. I loved doing the school musical. When I was grade 10, we did My Fair Lady, <laughs> which my brother was the lead in. and. That was with grandma and um, and I was like a cockney flower girl in the ensemble, which is really fun. And then in grade 12, I got to play Aunt Ella in Oklahoma. Oh, the hussy ought to be ashamed of herself. You too. How do you turn this thing to see the other picture? It's really like the encouragement of performing arts has been kind of what sparked my love of it. And I mean, I always loved it, but it was just nice to be able to have somewhere to funnel all that creative energy into. I love the winter uniform. Like I, I just think of like winters at Fair Home in the big woolly skirt and the blazer and your Panama just lying out in the sun on the oval. I think just like I really loved um, the tradition the traditional stuff. That was always really cool, like always singing Shine Jesus Shine and stuff like that that was like super, like such a fair home tradition. <laughs> this is like another big highlight is lining the driveway and singing and doing Jump and Jive. Everyone chanting, like that's just such a powerful, like fair homey kind of experience. That was such a big part of the life at Fairhome was the school spirit. And I think it's still, I think it will always be like that. <laughs>